morning. It is two days before the bear baiting, bear hunting season, so I'm getting ready this morning to take some baits out, freshen up the site. We've got one site that hasn't been hit yet, so we're heading in there. See if uh, see if it's gotten any activity over the last couple weeks. Hopefully they've found it. Um, we'll find out when we get down in there. Uh, so we've been baiting for about a about a month, and getting excited. Season starts two days, and had a lot of activity on other sites, but this one's this one's been quiet. So let's get in there. We'll see. Here we go. I'm getting in. What's up, guys? Uh, it's opening day. Bear season. About three o'clock in the afternoon. Getting the getting a couple of buckets of goods ready. Bucket number one. And bucket number two. Yep, smells good. Or uh, my special concoction. Not really special vanilla anise oil and just water and a little bit of cooking oil spray it all over the trees. Makes the wood smell awesome when you get down in there. So we've got a, lot of, got a bunch of bears activity down here, but a lot of it's at night. Um, so hopefully we'll get something coming in a little early tonight. And we can fill a tag and start the season off right. Opening day, 2022. Here we go. Well, it is Tuesday and uh, it is hot as hell. 87 degrees when I just pulled in, it's about 3.30. And uh, not exactly hunting weather, but can't shoot them on the couch, so I'm here. I head down in, I got a couple more buckets, freshen up the site. Um, try not to sweat my ass off so I don't stink like crazy. Uh, the good thing is a little bit of wind tonight. Last night was so quiet, it was silent, silent. It was, uh, I mean, I could hear my stomach rumbling. You get my leather belt squeaking every time I moved, and how I didn't scare anything away. But um, hopefully, there's a little bit of a breeze tonight. Once I get down there, and there, it's uh, it's like it's just nestled down in there. It protects it from the wind. So sometimes it's noisy up here and quiet down there. But I'm not supposed to get much cooler than I think like a low of like 80 degrees by the time I leave around seven tonight. So we'll give it hell and get in there. See what we can do. What's up, everybody? It's day four. Uh, weather has changed a whole lot. Equipment's uh, falling apart here. The uh, first two days we were up here was, I think it, Tuesday was 87 or something degrees when I got out. Right now it's maybe a little over 70 and it's windy, but it feels much better. I actually put a couple layers on because uh, temperatures are just much nicer. None of that heat crap. Um, so getting loaded up. It's Thursday, day four. Gonna get in there. The uh, bears have been really active. Had a bigger one come in last night. Um, pictures last night showed there was one that was in about, I think it was about a half an hour after I left last night. So pretty close. I feel like we're getting closer. Um, so again tonight, fingers crossed. Hope we get it done.
out a bear. Wow, this is not a huge bear. Oh, got a bear. Film it. Film the bear. Yes. Yes. Cut it down. Oh, it's just hard to moan, so I think you crash right down there. So I'm going to go down there. Check it out. See what we got. Oh, shit. Well, I didn't film the retrieval. Because I'm doing this by myself. I need to hold the rifle and a headlamp and a light and drag a jet sled. So, that work. Who do who? So that's it for bear for me. I get a thing loaded in the truck. Set seven nights. Haven't seen anything. Finally, Sal gave me the shot I wanted. Well, 20 minutes to spare. Bear season success. See ya.